Hey loves, for this tutorial I'm going to use only 5 ingredients to create my shea butter cream. Of course all the ingredients are optional, especially the Jamaican black castor oil. I picked up some free samples from a natural hair expo here in Atlanta and I wanted to use up my castor oil sample packets. So I figured why not utilize them for my mixtures. I'm pretty old school when it comes to measuring out ingredients so I guess they made it how much of each product I wanted to use to achieve a certain aesthetic as well as a certain fragrance for my mixtures. This was my very first time purchasing shea butter this pigmented and vibrant in color. Perhaps it was due to whatever dye was used in it, but it's taking some time to get used to and I'm going to use it anyway for this tutorial. So if I were to guess, I probably would use about 1 fourth cup of olive oil, 1 and a half cups of coconut oil, the entire container of shea butter, about 20 drops of peppermint oil, and 1 to 2 tablespoons of Jamaican black castor oil. This mixture will begin to soften up the longer you keep it in room temperature and here is just an example of comparing how pigmented my mixtures usually are compared to the one I just created. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Until next time you guys, bye bye.